Mám ten Facebook, ale sa tam strašne málo. Proti tomu, čo bolo kedy. Na tom Gmaili, tak tam tiež proste vyrieši fajne. Čiže takisto, že je radšej osobný. Ale Ríša, ty mieríš si za to. Poď! I believe that if I can see it, I can hit it. So that's when I realized that the targets were unlimited. There is absolutely nothing I cannot hit. Does Byron really never miss? And if so, is superhuman eyesight the only explanation? I'm here to find out if Byron Ferguson is the greatest archer on the planet. To demonstrate his ability, Byron asked for my wedding ring. He claims he can shoot an arrow right through its center. This little bitty ring, what kind of distance are we talking about? Uh, for that, between 10 and 15 yards. Probably 30 to 45 yeah. feet. Yeah. The center of the wedding ring is no bigger than a dime.
think you got it. <laughs> oh, man. Look at that. From this distance, if his aim had been off by 0 0.05 of a degree, he'd missed the ring completely. But he nailed it first time. That was brilliant. That was amazing. And he says no target is too small. The only limitation is that of the camera to be able to see the target. I can hit it, but sometimes the cameras just can't see it. For Dr. Murray's equipment to record accurate data, we need to test his ability using a target big enough for the machine to register. So the eye tracking experiment will measure Byron shooting tennis balls thrown by his wife, Wanda. All right, we're calibrated. Byron, you can fire when ready. There you go. All right. First shot, man, that was amazing. Did you see that? Byron's final test is a different ball game entirely. To find out how small a target he can hit, I'm setting him a superhuman challenge. To shoot an aspirin in midair and prove he's the greatest archer on earth. But as yet, we've only seen him employ this talent on a tennis ball, a target hundreds of times bigger than an aspirin. When I'm trying to hit a really small target, the first thing I do is visualize the arrow hitting the target. The concentration and the technique is what allows me to do it. There's nothing I can't hit. But this target is so small that we've got three cameras covering the action, including a super slow-mo camera, to find out if Byron actually hits the target or not. Oh my gosh. It looks like you hit it, but I'm not sure. Let's double check on the camera. There it comes. Hit it. Oh my gosh. Absolutely beautiful. I wouldn't believe it if we didn't have the slow motion camera. To have performed such incredible feats convinces me Byron Ferguson qualifies as superhuman. His ability to track and hit the...